Greetings, Harald. Time is short, so I will cut right to the chase. We have a crisis on our hands. Multiple dimensions were blent together in an incomprehensible mess. We call it the Shift. The history of entire worlds was rewritten into a grotesque parody of itself. So you are created to untangle it and put things back to order. To do that, you will have to activate seven interdimensional peers and get consent from the keeper of each dimension. Both tasks might prove not as straightforward as they sound. Most peers were torn apart, and dimension keepers, well, they are not quite themselves anymore. Expect to be opposed at every step of your way. Remember that those worlds are twisted and we don't know what to expect from its inhabitants. Also, we still don't know who or what is behind the shift. They might be a great threat to your cause. Though if possible, try to look out for potential alliances and beneficial contacts. By helping locals, you can get their support and invaluable intel that will help you on your mission. Remember, while your initial resources are limited, your potential is endless. There are thousands of different ways for you to tune and increase your powers. Not only your outside, but also your inside is upgradable and customizable. Get yourself a new spleen, heart, or even a brain. Each comes with unique effects that will decide your strengths and weaknesses and influence your gear choices. At the center of each herald's powers is their core. There are many different types of cores you can find and use. Each of them comes with a unique set of power-ups and most importantly, slots in which you can embed runes and nodes which will enhance your stats and abilities across the board. Do you want to focus on attack or defense? Want to increase your chances of making especially devastating critical blows? Or want to play it safe, increasing your basic strength? Choose your core and what you embed with wisely, and you will be unstoppable. You are not the only one who has special abilities and unique skills. Your enemies will evolve over time too. They can implement different devious strategies and be resistant or susceptible to various attack types that might be in your arsenal. Be smart, watch their moves and adapt. Use different consumables like temporary buffs, throwing daggers and grenades if your current build does not play well to your foe's strengths and weaknesses. Okay, we are really running out of time now, so I will sum this all up for you again real quick. Explore each dimension and evaluate the situation. Find seven cores in each dimension and pacify its keeper whatever the cost. Don't shy away from the help of the locals and also offer them help if you think that will benefit the mission. Increase your strengths and build your own fighting style by combining the potential of your gear, organs and core. Be always on guard. Adapt to incoming threats and stay one step ahead using your abilities and any additional tools you might find. And don't forget to regularly report back to Hub about any new intel that might be crucial to the mission. That would be all, Harold. The multiverse is waiting.